the Actin Black DTNVS. Let's go over this amazing binocular night vision system and find out if it has everything to hit your needs and applications. The Actin Black DTNVS came out towards the end of 2020, uh, early 2021, and it is the second gen of the legacy product, the DTNVGs. DTNVGs came out roughly around 2016, these coming out a few years later. And one great thing about Actin Black, they listen. So they listen to the feedback from professional users and the commercial market as a whole and put, you know, did what they could to make a better product, getting that information from actual end users in the field and they knocked it out of the park. So starting off, you have a fully articulating system. Now with an articulating system, one of the questions that always comes up is how strong are they? You're not going to have any concerns. Guys, you can torque on these things. You can do just about anything you want. They are insanely durable and very, very rugged. They are made out of fiber reinforced polycarbonate. And the way that they have put these together, they're, they're tanks. They are, they are absolutely just a very well built system that will uh, give you years and years of use. So starting at the front, they utilize PVS-14 optics, which is amazing because that way you have easy access to them. And if you were to break them, it is gonna be a very quick turnaround time. Here at Listen to Arms, any kind of service or repair, we usually don't have the device in for more than three to five days and we can have you back up and running, depending on if we have all the components in stock. So coming back, they will run off of a CR123 battery, giving you roughly around 25 hours of runtime. Right next to that, you have your power control knob, turning the device on and off, and also controlling the built-in IR illuminator that is right there on the bottom. Going over to the top, it utilizes a dovetail mounting system. So as always, we recommend the Wilcox G24. Going around, yeah, again, we've already talked about the optics. One thing that could be seen as a con is they do not come from the factory with IPD stops. IPD is your interpupillary distance. It's a distance between your eyes. And so they make a part that you can add on, again, it's not included, that you can set that to your IPD, your interpupillary distance. And that way when you bring them down, they will stop right where they are supposed to. Again, it's not a very cheap product. Um, they're coming in around about four or $500, um, you know, right now here in 2023. Um, but again, depending upon your preferences and your needs, it be up to you if you want to add that on. One of the great things about this system is that you can you, you can pick the tubes that are going to go into your device. Um, if you give us a shout here at Listen to Arms, we will have a conversation with you, find out your needs, your applications, and get a little bit of information about your environment. We'll make recommendations and we'll get you squared away with the absolute best set of intensifiers to go into your set of DTNVS. Uh, another thing that's great about these is they have independent pod shutoff. So if you are utilizing this device and you have them on a helmet and you roll one of the pods out of the way, whether you're doing admin tasks or you're wanting to use, uh, say, a thermal weapon site or anything like that, it will kill power to that pod. And then once you bring it back down, it will come back on. Now, the other thing that I'm not going to say is a con, it's going to be a user preference, is the DTNVS are an ABC system, standing for Automatic Brightness Control. So you do not have the ability to control the gain in your system to turn your brightness level up and down. So what they use is, is there is a board that is in here and utilizing that as, as well as the intensifier. It will adjust slightly to the environment that you're in. A lot of people really like that because it is very, very quick, easy, and it's nothing for you to have to mess with in the field, especially with professional users. They can simply throw a battery in, flip the device on, and they are up and running. And then simply if they want, while that's on their helmet, they can roll both of the pods out just like that. It's gonna kill power to both of those tubes. And then when they bring them down whenever they're ready to get to work. So with everything you have here, these, are still one of the lightest binocular night vision systems on the market, coming in just shy of 18 ounces, which is incredible. Now, there's a lot of new housings coming to the market pretty much every year, but no matter what, they're still having a hard time getting them to weigh less than the DTMVS, and if they do, was there a sacrifice in the durability and ruggedness of this housing? And 
can't really answer that right now, um, but I do know that there are thousands, tens of thousands of DTNVSs out in the wild, and we don't hear that much about them getting broken. They are very, very strong. I'm not saying you can't break them. Obviously, you can break anything, but with this, the way it's built under normal use and demanding use, you're not gonna have to worry about this breaking. These passed or exceeded all of the mil spec standards. They also passed the uh, US SOCOM testing protocols. They are water rated to 66 feet for two hours. So again, that's kind of a general overview. I think I've gone over everything that I need to. So again, just as a quick rundown over the Acton Black DTNVS, we have a full articulating system. We run off of a CR123 battery, giving you around 25 hours of runtime. We have our power knob on the front that controls the device's power of on and off and also the built-in onboard illuminator dovetail mounting system made out of fiber reinforced polycarbonate coming in less than 18 ounces and you can pick the tubes that go into these guys absolutely amazing set of night vision they are serving a world of people out there very very well and they'll give you years and years of life now if you are new to the night vision industry or sorry to the night vision community and you know you're trying to get all the information and just absorb everything you can I'll make a recommendation. Reach out to listen to Yarms. We don't have sales calls or anything like that. We have conversations. You shoot us a call, we'll go over your needs, everything, your environment. We'll give you some recommendations. We'll give you all the information that we can to make you an armed consumer. That way that you know that you are not wasting money or getting a device that is not gonna be perfect for your needs. As always, stay safe, stay dangerous, stay frosty. We'll see you guys out there.